Just like any of the other sculpting operations inside ZBrush, you can apply noise to a layer. This will give you more control once you've projected the noise to the actual mesh. So the first thing I'll do is choose the noise that I want. I'll just use these settings that I used in the last video. Then I'll open up my layer pulldown and click New to add a new layer. Once I have this new layer created, I'm going to click Apply to Mesh. Once that noise has been applied to the mesh, then you can use your intensity slider here in the layer palette to control the level of noise. I can turn it all the way down to zero, which will remove the noise, push it in a negative value, which will give me an inverted level of the noise that I had prior, or turn the intensity way up. And just as we saw in the last video, we can store morph target to control our noise. So for instance, now that I have this applied to a layer, I can set this intensity down to zero, go to my morph target pulldown, click store morph target, adjust the noise here in my layer intensity slider, and now that I have that stored morph target, I can selectively paint out areas that I don't want the noise to be applied to. Again, I have the morph target brush. So you can see between layers and morph target, you have an incredible amount of control over the noise that you can apply to the surface and where you apply that noise.